guys, welcome to my channel over here at Nene Northern Prepper. Yeah, it's been a little while um, since I've been on. Our whole family come down with the <coughs> cough cough. Um, we're all doing much better. Thank you everyone that sent out well wishes and prayers. I truly appreciate it. We all do. So, but today I am going to be uh, showing you Nene's Dollar General MRE. Okay, you can put together your own MRE, you know, and uh, have it on hand in case of an emergency. Now, um, a rule that I decided to uh, do would be everything that I picked would have at least a uh, one year uh, Best Buy date on it. So, in case I put this away and it's stuffed away for a little bit, it will still, uh, you know, have a longer uh, date on it. So, but as we know, a lot of things, you know, go way past that Best Buy date. So, um, and hopefully it's not too loud in here. I'm in my RV today and I have the furnace on. Um, still wearing a coat because a little bit nippy in here but um, anyway I figured I would bring you along and show you what I got from Dollar General to put in my MRE so and I have it right here Nene's MRE um, from Dollar General uh, the items that I have in here are things that I picked out from Dollar General to put in there. Now I picked out something for breakfast. I picked out something for a walk around snack and I picked up something for a morale booster. So um, yeah you want to stay tuned for this one guys. So I'm going to show you what I got here. <laughs> Since I get them all out of the Nene MR bag. <laughs> 2024, right? Okay. So, what I ended up getting was for breakfast, I got some of these uh, pastry, you know, like Pop Tarts, but they are the Clover. Valley brand, so an off brand, but the best buy date on it was past a year. I'll see if I can find it here for you. It was way out there. I have to put on, put on these glasses so I can see what it is, but uh, this is going out September 2039. Or am I looking at that wrong? <laughs> I don't know. But, you know, and I didn't put the whole box in there. I put this in here. They're already sealed in a nice pouch as it is um, to there. So that alone, you know, would be something to fill your stomach. Um, and along with it, I picked up um, a packet. Now, that was, I believe, a dollar for these. I'll double check. It wasn't much more than a dollar. And they also had these Bulger's uh, little pouches here. So, I'm putting not one because I love my coffee, guys. Uh, I am putting two in there. That way I could maybe have one, you know, later on in the day. Um, so, these little Folgers pouches are great. I've tried them before. They're not too bad. No, they're not your drip coffee, but uh, they will definitely, uh, you know, if you're a coffee drinker, better to have these than nothing at all. So, I'm going to put those back in Nene's MRE bag, and that is our breakfast covered. Okay, now for uh, lunch. What I picked up was 
Now, I'm not a big lunch eater. Um, if you wanted to, you could grab two of these. But the tuna salad uh, comes with the crackers. So, you know, for me, that would get me by for a lunch. Maybe you would need two of them, you know. But that's what I picked up for my lunch. And I forgot to put this with the coffee, but I have two waters here. The reason I have two, well, there's a couple reasons. Um, where was I at? <laughs> okay, I have the water there. Um, and we got the lunch. So, also I picked up some of these uh, little packets here. I forgot to take it out of the bag. But this here is some tea. It is uh, peach, peach tea. So, same like with the coffee, I can throw two of those in, you know, so. But, you know, some of these are pretty strong. I've tried some. Uh, this one I haven't tried yet. And a half of one is enough, you know, so you might be able to, like, put half in. Uh, at one time and the other half in later depending on how strong that you like it so that will go in Nene's MRE bag for Dollar General so we have lunch cover um, now I figured you know having like a little in-between snack you know walk around snack of uh, this cranberry blend trail mix uh, you know just something to uh, get you through between meals, you know, between maybe your breakfast and lunch, or your lunch and dinner, or either, or you don't have to eat it all at one time. So, and uh, the uh, best buy date on this here was, a, okay, that was February 28th of 2025. I don't know if you can see that right here. Right there. <laughs> My camera aim. Right there. Okay. So that is going in the news. MRE bag. Okay. Now for dinner. Okay. For dinner, I picked this Gentimore stew up. Okay. Um, when we were truck drivers, we used a lot of these, but we had a microwave, okay? So, um, you may be in a situation where you don't have a microwave, you can't use your microwave. There's other ways to heat this up. Everything is cooked in it. I mean, if need be, you could eat it cold. It would taste a lot better if you had it heated. Um, like I say, we use quite a bit of these. No, they're not the healthiest. They have a lot of uh, sodium in them but you know if you're uh, it's something you know that you could have in your MRE bag now also and I, I'll show you a few options of heating this up here uh, but before I get to that I'm gonna, one last thing I think we should all have something sweet and a morale booster and I figured my first choice would be where there's original. They can go right in my MRI bag from Dollar General. Okay, so some of the ideas that I thought would be uh, good to heat up, you know, maybe that little container would be like if you had some sternal cans, you know, and a little pan on top of it, you could heat it up that way if need be. Okay. That's one choice. Okay, if you have a little propane stove, you know, your little camping stove, um, this one's propane, you could use that. Don't use it inside. You don't want to, you know, um, <laughs> you don't want to get yourself in a worse off situation. So, always have ventilation when you use propane, you know, and even the sternal, you should actually have some 
ventilation going. Okay, and the last one, we use this on the road too. I've shown it before in other videos. If you have 12 volt, you can heat up through this like a, a 12 volt. I'm not going to take it out of the box, but that right there, okay? <laughs> Plug it into 12 volt, and you can heat up just about anything. Okay, so that is a, another option. Uh, you know, you can uh, put it in, uh, like with that, what I would do is put a little bit of water in there and uh, drop this right in there. Maybe put some aluminum foil underneath of it so it didn't melt that. But, you know, there is options. Or I could take and empty it and use my little pan here. You know, so many different options uh, that you could do. So, it's good to keep, you know, weights around and, you know, if you have some uh, plasticware or silverware that you can put in that bag as well. Uh, this here has, uh, I think, a little salt and pepper packet in it, a spoon, a knife, and fork. And also a little napkin, so I can put that in there as well. Get my water bottle in there. You know. And voila, you have <laughs> your MRE for one. I mean, everyone could have their own MRE. It doesn't take that much to make one. It wasn't really all that expensive. I think the most expensive item could have been the 10 more and it wasn't that much it was like uh, I think 250 it wasn't too bad at all you know so um, I should have wrote the price on it everything before I did the video and I didn't I'll try to tally up um, the total price for the MRE that I made from Dollar General to give you some idea so um, you know, I have a oxygen absorber, absorber. <laughs> you can always drop that in as well, you know. Um, and then you have your ready to go. I mean, you can take this to work with you. You can, um, you know, have it handy and ready for when an emergency comes. And then, you know, do with it what you want. And you'll have it, you know, in that emergency so I mean the whole family can make one you can choose different items to put in there you know and have a ready made meal for you in your homemade M party so um, if you enjoyed the video guys give me a thumbs up and subscribe thanks my <laughs> sorry my voice is still a little cracky you know but um, it is what it is and I love y'all and so glad that I can make a video today so um, it was a little rough going but we made it through so anyway till the next video guys see you in the next one to live God bless bye